What's going on guys? Epacmans is back with another Fortnite video and today we are looking at the long awaited season 9 Fortnite. Week 1. Cannot wait. Let's see what we got coming to us. I all I know is that this is supposedly going to be futuristic as you guys can see right there. I have no idea what to expect, but we're going to go check it out and see what's to come. All right. So I do want to say that I am going to do the challenges for week 1, but first I want to go over what Season 9 has to offer. So we're going to go take a look at the Battle Pass. So I'm telling you guys that now, so you guys, if you guys don't want to look and see what Season 9 has to offer with me, go ahead and skip this part. But before you do skip this part, I also want to say that this might be my last upload on a Thursday, unfortunately. I am... Uh, because I'm going to start a new job next week and that will not allow me to film through the day. So that means the earliest I will be uploading would be Friday. So I hope you guys continue to support me, even though it's going to be a day later. I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much for your continuous support. And then if you aren't subscribed already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also hit that bell button so you don't miss out on any future posts like this one. And let's go ahead and see what Season 9 has. So we do have to purchase the season, obviously. So we'll go ahead and do that in a little bit. But let's see what Season 9 has to offer. So we have rocks, this legendary outfit, she's pretty cool, uh, yeah, she's pretty cool, I guess. And we have this sentinel, I think sentinel is a little more cooler, I don't know, just because he's more robotic. I like this, uh, skin right here. So you got neo tubes, ride rippers. That's alright, I guess. You got the turbo spin glider. That's I like that glider. Kinda goes with the Avengers gliders that I've gotten. So this is gonna be the first skin that we get at 23. We're gonna get Bunker Jonesy. Okay. Long beard. Kind of Okay, so kind of like a default skin just with a longer beard. So we got Vibrant, Contrails, Cairo, what is this, like a cat, robotic cat, backpack. Oh, this is going to be a nice one to troll people. Oh yeah, nice. I like that one. Oh, we got Thor's Hammer? No, I'm just kidding. This is Bunker Basher, so this goes with the uh, Bunker Jonesy's skin. Okay. Oh, that's gonna be a sick emote. I like that. You guys hear that? Oh, that's sick. Can't wait for that one. Let's see, Vega. She looks badass. Not gonna lie. She looks. Wow, she looks really cool. I like her. Okay. Got banana contrails to use with Peely from the previous season. Box, Vokes. We got this cool harvesting tool right here. Pickaxe. I like it. Is that like a microphone, I think? Yeah, looks like it. The sign spinner. Oh, that's that's awesome. So when we get a victory royale, we you know we're spinning that sign to let the others know that we got it. Flying disc, okay. Stratus. Oh, this is uh, similar to one that we had in season four, I believe. Retaliator. So we got cool gliders, futuristic gliders, I would say, for this season. Storm. Okay, that's a nice skin. Three. Uh, live skin. It looks like. Demi, part of the Scarlet Dragon set, okay, does she do anything? I don't know, hopefully there's something else that goes along with her, I mean we have challenges so I'm assuming, oh this is just to unlock her harvesting tool and back bling, okay, 
She's alright. Got a laid back shelf for 95. Oh, we got the Dark Sentinel option. That's dope. And this is our 100 skin. Which I have to. No shade to the last skin, but the last 100 skin, as I've expressed many times, it sucked. I'm not gonna lie, just it sucked. This one is a lot cooler. So I'm looking forward to getting this 100. Okay, so we have this Fort Bite um, challenges, I guess. So we have to gain 175,000 XP for the first one. Then we have 10 over here for 60,000 and so on, all the way to 99 for gaining 125,000 XP. Okay, we'll see what that gives us. Then we have Utopia, so complete all challenges, collect 94 bits, complete all challenges from any week, and so on. Okay. I and mean, this will give us that one mystery character. But let's take a look at what week one season nine has to offer. All right, so back to the stage challenges. Stage one of two, ride the slip stream around Neo Tilted. Ooh, Neo Tilted. Okay, I'm, I'm pretty sure this is the futuristic til Tilted Towers. Okay. Visit all sky platforms. Okay, so now we have sky platforms. That's interesting. Deal damage to an opponent within 10 seconds after using a Shadow Bomb, okay. Pick up a legendary item in different matches. Search chests at Lucky Landing or Loot Lake. Scoped weapon eliminations and stage 1 of 3 deal damage to opponents from at least 2 stories above. Okay, so this is all going to be done. You guys already know Team Rumble. We're going to go ahead and equip one of the new skins that I got. By the way, I did get the Avengers Quinjet. I didn't make a part 2 to it only because I didn't finish all of the challenges unfortunately I was really busy but I did get the Quinjet and you guys will be able to see it here. So I guess the first place we're going is Neo Tilted. You can also see Mega Mall where Rito Row was. That's cool. And I'm kind of sad that they didn't take out the winter stuff because we're kind of past winter over here at least in America so I don't know I think they should have eliminated it just my opinion I guess. Oh, these must be the slip streams. Let's ride one of these. That's what I have to do. Yeah, there we go. That's sick. That's actually really cool, actually. I wonder if you could shoot and get Elims through those things. You probably could. If I had a guess. Oh, we got a new weapon? What is this? It says, pick oh, I got credit for picking up a legendary weapon, even though I didn't know purple was considered legendary, but okay. So what do we have here? We got a combat shotgun, so rest in peace to pump. Is that true? That is kind of sad, guys. I, I enjoyed the pump shotgun, not going to lie. You can see it over there. So this is going to be the first guy platform that we visit, hopefully if we get there, which I'm pretty sure we should. So this is kind of like Apex, because Apex has the that one ship, the loot ship or whatever, that is up above the map. It just reminds me of the Apex. Let's see. Okay, so this is one of seven, guys. This is it's just a simple ship, but imagine the sky bases you could do up here and then the people you could eliminate from up here. That's pretty cool. So this is one of seven new ones that they've added. And I'm curious to see the rest. So I need three scoped weapon eliminations and I'm gonna try to do this here. Oh wait, look! We have another sky base here, guys. I didn't even see this. Well here's the second one. In case you guys were wondering where it was. It's right over here. It's they're pretty hard to miss. I mean they're pretty big and you guys can see. First E limb right there. One of three. Oh, and that actually counted for, what did it count for? Deal damage to opponents from at least 
two stories above. Okay, I did 250. Cool. 250 out of 300 right there. Let's see if I can get a Elam here. He stays still. Oh, this guy. There's one. Let's see if I get this banana right here. There's another. And there's my 300 of 300 from two stories above. Okay, what else do we have to do? So we have to ride the slipstream around Mega Mall. Okay, I want to check out Mega Mall. Then we have to continue to visit the Sky Platforms. Oh, deal damage to opponents from at least four stories above. That's interesting. Okay, four stories. Okay, we're going to go to Mega Mall and that's on the other side. Enemy territory, but we're still gonna go. Alright, so here's the challenge. Okay, so not much has changed with the volcano itself. However, there is a plant now, okay. That's uh, something new, I guess, and that's pretty cool. We'll check it out after we check out this sky base. So this is 3 of 7, okay, sweet, and now I want to go check out the volcano, okay, so it's not going to erupt anymore since it's already erupted and there's a plant literally over the volcano, oh, here's a legendary combat, nice, So here's four out of seven, and nobody even got a chest up here, so I'll take that. So this guy's going for the supply drop. Got him in my scope. Got him. So that had to be above four me four stories. And it was. So I need 100 more damage. Oh, that actually counted too. Okay, cool. I guess I just have to be four stories. I don't have to be four stories from them. Oh, ho, ho, that was a nice night. That'll do it for the four story challenge. So now we gotta deal damage to opponents from at least six stories above. That's only 100 damage. And then we gotta continue with the pick up a legendary item in different matches. We still have to search the chest and visit the rest of the sky platforms. Okay. And we need to find a shadow bomb because I have not found. I have yet to find one still. There's one chest. Cool. We'll take it. So has anything changed with Loot Lake? I have yet to see. Kind of. I mean, you see more, more trees here than before. So that's that's cool. We're in the future for season nine, but what if we went back to the past for season ten? Imagine that, and then we get like the OG map. That would be sick. Oh, we got a fifth chest. Cool. Did not expect that. So we got five chests at Loot Lake. Right off the bat. And we're going to get one more sky base. So this is number five.
There's got to be at least 37 damage. And it was 37 exactly. I just need two. There's one. I just need one more. Here's two. Cool. So there we go. I also need that smoke bomb. I haven't seen it at all. I didn't even know it was supposed to be rare. This is the sixth sky base that we visited. So this is the last sky base that we have to visit. Our seventh one to be exact. Looks like we got some company here. my legendary weapon for this game. Got a legendary sniper and you know I love snipers. There's 105 damage. Hopefully that's over six stories. We'll see. And it is. Awesome. So just one sniper shot and we're good. Wow, here's my legendary for this challenge hopefully oh it didn't give me credit okay that's odd Let's see if this counts there we go so for some reason this gold infantry did not count but this gold pdw did so either way i got the challenge done as you guys can see and all we needed to find is a shadow bomb which i have yet to find in any of my matches So six people left and uh, I'm just honestly just trying to get this challenge done Been trying to work for it for a few hours now because I didn't realize that this shadow bomb is not available in Team Rumble guys so just a heads up I'm literally doing solos have as you saw before like about 150 damage so I need 50 more Let's see if I can get it right here Peekaboo. That is a pretty cool loading screen, honestly. So we are... So I think you can see it on the gun, it says I5, I6, J5, J6, so it's going to be in that intersection. You see it on the minigun, and well, I guess that's where it's going to be at. We're going to go take a look to see if it's true. Okay, so again, it's I5, I6, J5, J6, so that will leave it right there. Somewhere right there. So kind of by Lonely Lodge, and that is enemy territory, so I'm just going to go in, get it, call it call it a day, make sure to get this video uploaded for you guys, and I hope you guys are enjoying Season 9 so far. Oh yeah, right here. Awesome. So that is it for week one of Season 9. I hope you guys all enjoyed. Season 9 is looking pretty cool. I like the futuristic theme. I hope I just hope they don't overdo it, but so far, it doesn't look too bad. We'll see once I start playing with my friends and squads. Uh, right now, I've just mostly done uh, just the challenges. But other than that, 
I hope you guys did enjoy like I said, and if you did, make sure to subscribe down below if you haven't already. Also turn on that bell button so you don't miss out on any future posts like this one. And then just a reminder guys, I will no longer be uploading Thursdays, unfortunately, just because I will be working and this job provides me to be obviously at work throughout the day, so I won't be able uploading as early but it should be as early as friday hopefully after work i'll start grinding on these challenges and you can expect my videos my new upload date on friday and also if you guys want to support me make sure you use my code in the item shop epacmans all capitalized i would really appreciate it thank you so much and as always i'll see you guys in the next video peace out